Okay, thank you all for uh, for tuning in to my blog so far. I think it's been been going quite well. I had a few comments about trying to make them a bit shorter, so I am going to try and not ramble on in this one. So, Brands Hatch the weekend. Um, I did a uh, did a blog after the after qualifying. So you know how that went. The three races on on Sunday were good. Went well. We had a um, well. First of all, the the results. We had a thirteenth. A DNF, unfortunately, um, a bit of, bit of contact at the start of the race was uh, was a bit odd. Um, and then a um, from the back of the grid, we came to thirteenth again in the third race. So you know, not the kind of results that um, I became accustomed to last year, but a fantastic start for us as as the team. We 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 had solid finishes. The car was good over a race distance. It it lasted well. And in in the last race, we were actually only nine tenths off the fastest lap and, and generally about half a second off everyone else. I know there's ballast and everything comes into play there, but we did make good improvements through the day on, on the chassis. So I'm feeling pretty confident that, that it's all it's all going to plan. It worked really, really well with the team. We all bonded very well, worked worked well together as a as one complete unit and um, I've come away really happy and more more confident than I have been um, in the past that this is this is going to work out really well. For those of you that, that followed really closely you, you would have noticed that we've got a bit of a lack of, of straight line speed at the moment and we don't quite know what it is but we, we have identified our, our biggest time loss around a lap is, is a lack of straight line speed and it's, it's around seven or five miles an hour in some of the speed traps and, and they're generally halfway down the straight so by the time we're we're into the corner, we're, we're looking at a bit more. We've got a few ideas about where this could be coming from, so the team are actually hard at work as I, as I record this, looking into it. We're going to get the engine checked out, we're going to check out whether there's some drag um, through the gearbox or any of the other drivetrain. It could be aero, but, but I very much doubt it. But we're going to look at everything and, and hopefully get a handle on it and get it sorted for Donington. I really believe if we can we can get that aspect sorted, the, the chassis should still be good. Um, having more power is going to change it slightly but not dramatically so it'll just be a case of, of fine tuning it again and then we we start looking at other areas but I do believe if we get that done we'll be um, we'll be up there for Donington I'm looking forward to it Donington's one of my favorite circuits and uh, I'm already two minutes thirty so I'm gonna cut it off there and I'll come back to you um, later in the week if we find anything with the car if not it'll be just before Donington thanks for thanks for watching